Hey, what's up guys, I'm Nizio Cole, and today I'm actually gonna be showing you guys how to set custom game artwork on Steam. Now, if you're like me, you have a bunch of games in a folder, and uh, they look really nice together, except for one game that has some artwork that isn't sized properly. So the first thing that you could do is go on Google and search up whatever game it is. For me, this is Miss Messages, and that's good and all, but none of these are in the right dimensions, and I could scale them up, but you know, on things like this, there are text. So it's really just easier for me to add my own text. So I'm just gonna download this. The next thing that you'll need is a photo editing software, whether it be Photoshop, GIMP, there's a bunch of free ones out there. Um, and then the main thing you, that you wanna make sure of is that the resolution is set to 720 by 1080. Now, once you have your artwork in Photoshop, it's really up to you how you want it to look. For me, I kinda want it to look as close to the original artwork as possible, cause I actually really like that style. So I'm just gonna scale it up to make sure it fits the entire frame. And then as far as the text goes, I actually do have a font that looks really similar. It's called Nexa Bold, but that's just for this game. This website's like defont.com, which I'll have linked in the description if you wanna go look for a font that looks like the same font on the original game's artwork. But uh, for this, uh, this is way too big. So I'm just gonna turn this down and just type Miss. The main thing is to just make sure it looks clean. And then if you want to, you can add something like a drop shadow to your text, make it look nice, make it look like it sticks out from the, the background. And if you guys notice in the original artwork, there's like this kind of like see-through effect on the text. So you guys want to know how to do that. Um, basically, you want to set the color of the text to not white, but like a kind of like a yeah, like a whitish, whitish gray color, and then set the blending mode to vivid light. And there you go. And then once you're done with that, you can go to whatever game that you had on Steam. Right click, manage, set custom artwork, and then find where the picture you just made was. Click on it, and there you go easy as that. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any questions or down in the comment section below and I'll see you guys later. Peace.